thank you very much. Uh, it, it really means a lot for us because winning a, a, being a financial product and winning an award coming from one of the biggest financial institutions in Spain and one that is uh, betting that much for, for technology means a lot to us. So Kobe is an, an employee benefits company and what we're doing is we're, we're focusing on all kind of benefits for the employees and salary sacrifice formulas but we, we're doing it in a, in a certain way that it's much more clearer for the employees and the company. So we're bringing all kind of offering that is in the market nowadays with cards, different groupons, different uh, discount clubs, insurance. We're bringing it down to a single product that is a Visa card for the employees so that they have a very clear understanding of the value proposition of all the benefits that each company is offering them. Yeah, well, now we have the biggest challenge, right? Because it was well, it was already a challenge and the, the, the quality of the startups here in Spain was very good. We are very happy to, to have won this, this prize. But now the, it comes a real challenge. We are one of the three finalists for the Global Award and there we are competing with the rest of the world. So, so for the biggest fin fintech competition in the world, uh, it's going to be hard, but we are very motivated, so we'll see what happens. So my opinion is super positive because I, I like when big corporations try to, to help and identify innovations that are brought by small companies. There are other big corporations that believe that maybe startups or small companies were not doing much or anything, nothing innovative that they cannot do. But for me, that's not the truth. And, and for BBVA, I believe it's, they don't think so either. So this is a demonstration that they believe on the talent, they believe on the innovation and on the small startups that can do things that, that sometimes are not done by big corporations. Well, my first recommendation would be to, to apply, no matter if you think that you might not be selected. I think it's good that you always apply because when you apply to different processes, that there are so many awards, that it's good you learn from one to another what went well and what failed. So first thing would be to apply. And, and yeah, second thing is if, if they are selected to, to come in, to, to be kind to the people behind, to understand very well what they can uh, what they can gain from this program. Well, the process has been super lean, so it was super clear in the web page how to apply, what were the dates, what information to be filled, and, and that was super clear, but the best thing of the, of the process was the people behind. So they were sending us emails when we were selected, even calling us, and like they were very, very aware, and, and, and that was very super supportive for us. Well, that's a, a good, good question. I think, first of all, you need to be to, to speak calmly because many times people want to say many things and it's better to say a bit less with the keywords that you want to say. So speak calmly would be one thing. Second is to touch the different verticals that the people want to hear because not, it's not just talking about your product. You also need to identify the problem clearly, say how you are addressing this problem, uh, what revenue model you have, the team behind. So there are many different topics that you need to, to, to put in there. And third, I would say, is you need to, to, to a bit show enthusiasm. So it's like, okay, you believe in your idea and, and it's important that the rest of the people feel so, so that they also believe on that and, and that they feel that you believe on the idea.